Hi, my name is Jay and I have cystic fibrosis. I haven't talked about it a lot because it's hard to talk about. Not in an emotional way, but in the way that it's tough to communicate an experience that's personal to you to a bunch of other people when you don't really know their experience. Now, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm not a doctor. However, I've done a little research on Wikipedia and I have an idea of how lungs work. Um, having something like CF, which is essentially the process of being clogged up with mucus at all times, you end up learning some things that I don't think the average person would learn throughout the course of their lifetime. Like I know a little more about how lungs work than let's say someone who's never had to bring their lungs into the shop before. So with the help of this lung model, I'm going to attempt to communicate how CF feels to me. Now, as I said, CF is the process of being clogged with mucus at all times. What happens is my cells can't move salt and water properly. So my pancreas doesn't work right. My lungs are filled with crap and it's a hassle. You look, that's what my lungs are filled with at most times. Uh, this is not the first take of this, so I've tried this a few times. It's normally a little more than that. Uh, I'm not going to fill these lungs with this mucus because that's disgusting. Uh, really, I normally don't spit it at my hand either or wipe it on a deck. But in, in the interest of time, we will. Now, normal lungs are not taped together. CF lungs are. Actually, what happened was I bought a $4 lung model off of eBay, and my lovely fiance Becca, spent an hour and a half trying to put it together. The, the instructions are terrible, uh, but packing tape is wonderful, so here we are. So you have airways, and you breathe, and air goes into them. That's why they're called airways. Uh, it brings the air through to very carefully, not tearing the lungs apart here. Yeah, oh God. <laughs> to your bronchial tree right air. Getting air to those is very important because that's where it needs to be. Again, I'm not a doctor. Um, in the normal lung, you have a thin slippery mucus that sort of keeps things out of there like cigarette smoke or bacteria, barbecue sauce. I don't know what's in your lungs. I don't know what you're inhaling all the time. So in a normal lung, these would be coated in just like a, a watery type substance or so. If I'm wrong about this, please tell me, because I don't know, because I don't have normal lungs. So you end up, like, you know, mucus, it's nasty, that's great, everyone's disgusted. And let's say that somehow someone is smoking a bunch of flour around you. I don't know, I'm just using flour because you can see it. But particulates sort of end up on the lung there, and then what happens to them? Oh, the thin, silvery mucus comes through and cleans them off, and everyone's happy. It makes a mess on your deck. And that's great. CF lungs, not only are they taped together, but they are essentially filled with Junior Bear honey flavored syrup. So, in the CF lung, you've got the bronchial tree just covered in this crap here. The lungs do. Let's get them all. Right down the airway. Right, so that's great. And now you take the honey and you put it in there and it's stuck. So what do you do? You try to cough it up. What's that make? More honey flavored syrup coming up and it's just not washing the flour out. So you end up with inflammation because you're trying so hard to get this honey flavored syrup out. It's not working. You get these little clumps of mucus with stuff in them. So what you need is medicine. I use a drug called Pomozyme that actually makes my mucus about half as thin. It's supposed to be half as thin. I don't actually know. But it thins it out so that maybe this stuff will move along. And I don't have a whole lot of water left in here, but let's pretend this is Pomozyme. And the Pomozyme goes right in there and you clean that right out. Still, you're filled with stuff, but you might have a little airway that you can get through. I also do a salt water treatment, which is essentially just inhaling salt water. And what that does is it, it salts these, these lungs nicely and the, the salt gets inside the honey flavored syrup and your body will sort of direct water towards it and hopefully cough that stuff up and out.
but I would like this to stop. So if you have a cure, um, send it to me. I don't care. I'll try anything at this point. Um, and otherwise, just thanks for watching. Bonus parts. I didn't do bonus parts. Yeah, you did too. Did I? On the table. Okay. Bro, come on. What do you think? It's pretty good. Pretty good? You're pretty angry. You come across as an angry dude. Try it again? No. That's just you.